Hey guys, what's up? Donnie three two one here. Just doing a nice little, uh, really quick Dark Souls three video for you guys to see. I have I've loved playing this game every single second of it. Um, I guess the main reason I'm doing this video is because I just felt like uploading a really quick Dark Souls three video, just for um some souls farming for when you're later on into the game so just in case you're not I'm gonna say spoiler alert right now but if you're curious anyway then just keep watching so what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the bonfire and we're gonna head off to oh yeah by the way I'm still on my first journey just so you just so you know just so you understand the numbers so I'm still on my first journey. What you want to do is you want to teleport to Grand Archives. Okay. When you are here, you do need to go through Grand Archives because what you want to do is you want to activate this um, shortcut. Now, once you've activated it, you can use this to ride up. And once you're up, you want to do a roll out because that gets you out and sends the lift back down. And then once you pop out, you want to come up these stairs. And right up here is a certain boss which isn't exactly which is relatively easy I'm not going to explain who it is what you want to do is once you come out these double doors and you're at these stairs turn left climb these steps around this building over onto this roof and up these stairs now you'll notice up there there are three winged enemies now these guys can drop. There's a 100% chance for giving you a large titanite shard or titanite chunks, but they can also drop their weapons. Now, what we're going to use is we are going to use uh, the shield of want because it increases the amount of increases the number of souls absorbed when enemies are defeated. We're also using the standard Silver Serpent Ring. You can get plus one and plus two in this in later new games. Um, the Hornet Ring to boost critical attacks. Chloranthi Ring just for, you know, quicker stamina recovery. And increased strength because I'm a strength build and it just gives me that little bit extra damage. Another thing we're also going to use is the Symbol of Avarice. Now, obviously it still works the same, gives you extra souls, but reduces your health over time so you have to be mindful of your health so now that we've got all this on we're gonna go fight these guys they're relatively simple to you know understand their moveset and predict what you want to do is you want to get rid of this guy first relatively easy to I would say easy to backstab them but it can be a bit of a pain but with all this equipment on I get 25,740 souls and as you can see he dropped a large titanite shot so now we'll come running around here we'll fight the other one who has got some twin axes what is he doing Backstab. Backstab. And again. Dead. Let's jump to the last titanite shard again. 25,740 souls. Now we'll run in here and kill the third one. Very, very simple to kill these guys. 
I would be careful though because some of their attacks can completely drain your stamina if you are a melee person. There we go, that's the third one dead. He dropped a titanite chunk this time. And that's all it is. And then all you do is, if you've got some homeward bones, use them. Or if you went and fetched the coiled sorg fragment, use that. Bonfire last rested up. And it respawns them and you get sent back to the Grand Archives. Simple as that. Now, the run can take, depending on, you know, your stats and how much damage you can do. The run can take a couple minutes. But with, you know, with the Shield of Want, a standard Silver Serpent Ring, and Symbol of Avarice, you get 25,740 souls. Times that by three enemies, and you get, what, 75,000... Um, yeah, I'll just put the number up on the screen. I can't be bothered to sit here and work it out. But yeah, it is really quick to get a big bunch of souls. And all you do is you just repeat that process. And that's where I'm going to leave it. It's a nice quick soul farming video for later on in the game, if any of you didn't know. And I hope you enjoyed it. See you guys later.